Do you want to create text wrap just like this? Hello, type choice here. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to create text wrap and how to wrap text around an image. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Before you start in InDesign, you actually have to start in Photoshop and you need to find the image you want to make the text wrap with. I found this image of a golf ball and let's say I want to wrap text around this golf ball. The first thing we need to do is actually mask this golf ball out. You can do that in different ways. You can use the lasso tool, the quick selection tool, or just the pen tool, and many more. In this case, I'll use the pen tool. The keyboard shortcut for that is P. And let's just zoom in on our ball right here and mask it out. When you're done masking out your object, you need to go over to the Layers panel and choose Paths. And as you can see here, there is now a selection. You now want to hold down Control and click on the selection. And as you can see, the selection we just created is now active. Now you can name it something. Let's just name this Golf Ball. And press OK. Make sure you stand on the right layer. Then go into Paths and select our selection. Then go up in Layer and choose Vector Mask and Current Path. And then press Ctrl D and the background is now gone. And what this does is that when you import this PSD file into InDesign, it will remove the background and from there you can create the text wrap. So let's just say this is fine. We can now crop the image right here so we just have the golf ball let's just say this is fine for now just press check on this or enter and let's just save this as a psd file you can just name it whatever you would like and press save now go into your indesign file and we want to import this psd file we just created so press ctrl d on your keyboard and find the image we just saved and drag it into your document right here. Now we want to place it on our page. So let's just center it right here and we can scale this up a bit, just like this. We now need to find the text wrap panel. If you haven't this already, you can go up in windows and choose text wrap, just like this. In here, there is some different options as you can see right here. You want to select the golf ball image right here and choose the third one, which name is wrap around object shape. So we just press on this and in wrap options, you want to set this to both right and left sides. And in contour options, this is really important. You want to find the Photoshop path and this right here. That is the selection we created in Photoshop before that it will use. So make sure to select that. And you can also see the name of the path we named it. And you can now start to press on this arrow to wrap it around the text. This looks pretty good. You can also move this around and the text will wrap around this. You can also scale this up in a really large size. And let's add this up. You can create a lot of cool effects with this if you use some time on your masking, as you can see right here. And if you have some advanced objects or photos you can create some really nice things if you want to remove the text wrap again you can just press on this no text wrap and it will disappear thank you so much for watching i hope this video was helpful don't forget to subscribe and like the video and comment down below what video we should do next that was all for now see you in the next one